Good morning. Look at this. Oh, what do you got? Oh yeah, you, you see know if, that? You know if we got this stuff in our bowl, you know what day it is. Look, it's marshmallow. Cheat day. And guys, we found one of the best new cereals that you're ever gonna see or taste in your life. And I hope that you guys get it everywhere that you're watching in the States and all over Canada, because we found it. And it looks like by the packaging and stuff that it's probably gonna be like one of those limited, only gonna be here for the summer type things. So get it if you can. It's awesome. They basically took a couple different cereals like Honeygrams and Cocoa Puffs. Yeah. And some marshmallows and they uh, put them all together and then threw like way more sugar on them. It's amazing. Try this out for you guys. We had it last week. Oh, um, it's so good. It's it's amazing. We had a friend of ours get some cereal from the States called Kellogg's S'mores. And this cereal is better than that. The marshmallow actually tastes sort of like real marshmallow. Show. Kind of fakish, but... Show that. Yeah, but all cereal marshmallows are weird, but, but good. That combo is just beautiful. Mm. Oh, I'm doing a mix. Whoops, a few extras got in there. Okay, so underneath is that s'more cereal, but look at these. And I'll show you in the middle. Oh, there's supposed to be chocolate in there, but <laughs> it's missing. It is double chocolate crepe. We get normal crepe here that a friend of ours picked it up in the States for us. Put some milk. And you know what else it's good for? If you're having a craving for chocolate. <laughs> here we go. Mm. Cereal is like the best thing. It's always usually the first thing we eat on cheat day and it's always like one of my favorite moments mm. of the entire week. That crave tastes like extra good in milk. You even got a Ninja, ninja Turtle head. Oh in yeah. Uh, you guys know we're famous for our mis mishmash of cereals <laughs> from like months and months ago because we just keep adding new cereal. Yeah. They stay fresh though, you just keep piling them on and enjoying. Mm -hmm. Got some apple cinnamon Cheerios in there, some all sorts of stuff. Mmm. Delicious. So Worth every workout. Right, Hank? Our second most favorite thing on cheat day. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, oh, Pop Tarts. They usually follow the cereal. Okay, so. $1.97 Pop-Tarts. We didn't already have six boxes, so we had to get new ones. Yep. So, s'mores. And this one is a special one. Um, this other one that we're going to do, s'mores and cinnamon roll. Mm. Cinnamon roll is also from my friend who, um, who went to the States. And we tried these last week, and... If you haven't tried them and you can get them, they're not lying. They taste exactly like they're cinnamon awesome. rolls. Like, I would have a million boxes of those if like, we could get them. Why can't we get these in Canada? Like, Canadians are obsessed with cinnamon buns. You know what I mean? Like, we have them everywhere. I don't know, but I, if I could, I would go and buy like 10 boxes of those because they're so good. So here's the s'mores one. Cool. And put one on your plate. And I'll break it in half for you, friends. Oh my, look at that. Now, I haven't had a s'mores pop tart in a really long Ooh, time. it looks so good. It does, and it wasn't my favorite. But I remember loving them as a kid. So, I love the, the middle looks yep. very tasty. Looks awesome. Okay, I'm going to take a bite. Mmm. Mmm. That's way better than I thought. Like, I don't know what we were like. Delusional. Last time, I don't know what we were thinking. It, yeah, like, the, we, it it's was like, a long time ago that we had them, but we were like, ah, oh, they're not our favorite. But 
I knew no, that we should we, probably give them a second chance. We were wrong because these are really good. <laughs> There's like a marshmallow flavor in there, but it also is like this similar flavor to the chocolate fudge ones. Mm. It's really good. You want you want to you eat yours? Oh, I'm, yeah. Let me let me. Uh, I'll break this in half and try it out. I can help you. The other half, I'm probably gonna dip in uh, in our cappuccino. Oh yeah, you gotta dip it. So there's a close up. Yeah, you get your marshmallow, your chocolate, a little bit of frosting. They could have been a little more generous with the frosting, but I'll, for, I'll forgive Pop Tart. Trust That's me, it. you don't need it. It's okay, Pop Tart. I forgive you. We forgive you. And look at these babies, cinnamon roll, and. The pastry on these cinnamon roll ones is amazing. Like, I love Pop-Tart pastry, but this is, like, extra special. Yeah, we were nuts. These are amazing. I know. What was wrong with us the that day? The s'mores Pop-Tarts are amazing. Okay, so this is cinnamon roll, and look at that inside. Mm. So you get the icing on top and the nice pastry. Oh, my gosh. This is... Mmm. The pastry is like really buttery. Um, the inside is full of cinnamon goodness. It's the perfect mix of everything. And um, these are amazing. These are like, I think these are one of my favorites. Yeah, you get good brown sugar cinnamon action in there for sure. Mm -hmm. Let me mm. try a bite. Here, YouTube, ready? You can have a bite too. Mmm. Good. Oh, yeah. Really good. Eat these. Mmm. Mmm. We did stop because I had a donut craving at, look, Tim Hortons. And oh, normally yeah. we don't have luck, but today they were full. We stopped at a different Tim Hortons and they were stocked. And look at this, whoopie pie donuts. Those look amazing. They look amazing. My favorite ever donuts, toasted coconut. Got a vanilla and a chocolate, Boston cream, apple fritters, um, you know, sprinkles, maple dip, and glazed cinnamon roll. And what we don't eat can go in the freezer. And guess what? It's Hank's cheat day too. Na 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 na. Plain Timbit. Hi, high five. Good boy. You like that, buddy? Bang. <laughs> Bang. Say, good boy. Happy cheat day. Whoopie pie, look at that. So it looks like two <laughs> chocolate donuts and in between. Oh, look. Look at that. That does look like a look whoopie pie. Chocolate chips and chocolate icing on top. That looks really good. It looks like the Boston cream glazed chocolate on top too. Mm. Yeah, delicious. Mm. Does it taste like a whoopie pie? No. No? Now you said your grandma used to make them for you when you were little, right? Yeah. But yeah. not the donuts, but the whoopie no. pies. Hers were like a cake, a chocolate cake filled with like, um, like vanilla icing. Mm -hmm. This is like a Tim Hortons donut, but it's got like whipped cream and chocolate chips. It's not a whoopie pie, but it, it's really, really good. It looks delicious. Mm. That was a good choice you made. Your turn to make some whoopee. Mmm. That's what my grandma used to call love. Whoopee. 
You kids are making whoopee down at the river again, aren't you? Mmm. Mm-hmm. The chocolate is like the Boston cream glaze on top. And um, it has like, I want to say like Long John filling cream in the middle. Yeah. It's delicious. It's very good. Very mm. chocolatey. And then you get that whipped cream center. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Mmm. You like it? Get this, guys. This is good. Mmm. They're like chips. You can't eat just one. <laughs> Probably going to eat all these. Not going to lie to you guys. Oh, you got garbage. Look at this. Toasted coconut. Mmm. My most favorite donut in the land. I've had the chocolate mm. toasted coconut, but I've never tried the uh, vanilla. Or oh. just the plain, I guess you'd call you it. You're going to love it. Mm. And you had this one before, right? Oh, my yeah. favorite. Many of mm. days. <laughs> I love here. it. Mm. It looks like KFC crispy chicken, but it's a donut. Coconut. They're so fresh. Okay, I'm going in. Mm. It's so good. Oh, what my. do you think? I would never steal your wrong. I love coconut and this donut has always been my favorite. Mm. It's so fresh. Mm-hmm. How do they do that? Mmm. If anyone else ever loves these as much as me, let me know. Or, tell us. I didn't think you would talk chocolate toasted coconut. Oh, this is the one. Mm -hmm. Let us know what your favorite donut is. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, it can be from Tim Hortons or from wherever you get your donuts. Star, what, no. Krispy Kreme, Dunkin' Donuts, any bakeries that you guys know of. Because mm. we like donuts. And food. <laughs> Okay, so you have to compare, right? You can't just have the normal coconut without trying the chocolate coconut. So yeah, it looks the exact same. It's just a chocolate donut on the inside. Mmm. That one's really good too, but I think the original is always going to be my favorite. Mmm. <laughs> Delicious? Mmm. I like... I like how they put like an icing... I know, I really like that sweet icing in between the coconut and the donut. I think it's probably their chocolate glaze and then they dip it in coconut. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's really good, but the chocolate overtakes the coconut. Yeah, the vanilla one is the best. The original toasted coconut, the coconut is the star of that one. Like, it shines on that. Mm. But the chocolate one is really, really good. And it's it's actually really rare that you can find the original one now at Tim Hortons. Like, yeah. I've n I haven't seen it there in a long time. We only ever see, yeah, that one. The, the chocolate, chocolate one. Yeah. And I was sad because as a little girl, that's what I got. Even a weird donut for a kid to get, but it was my favorite. Wow, today, Timmy's, you came through. You saved the day. Did it. It's lunchtime. We're going to eat some chips. Flame and hot. These are from the states, and we tried them last week. They're pretty good. They're like if you've ever had um, a barbecue flavored chip. They're like that with the heat turned up just a little bit on those. So those are good. Um, we also have some Smart Food white cheddar, and it is tasty. And craft dinner with some butter on the box. <laughs> Get it all pre measured up and ready. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yep. So that's gonna be our lunch, and boy, is it gonna be tasty. Oh, yeah. Oh, and maybe some of these. De -de -de. What's that? Munchies. Mm -hmm. Whoa. And don't forget swigs of this <laughs> black cherry. What, what is it? Flavored water, right? Yeah, it's sparkling water. Um, just like the fruit two O's that we show you guys all the time, but this is I used to drink this when I was younger, and it is It's amazing 
That is, this is the best flavored water I've ever had. Kyle was really surprised. Yeah, it's it's amazing. Black cherry is the best. They have lime, but if you guys see this, um, it's the one to try, black cherry. Awesome stuff. Butter boxes. <laughs> oh yeah, and you can't forget ketchup for your craft dinner. Now, let us know guys, are you a ketchup craft dinner person or are you a traditional no ketchup craft dinner type? Can't forget chip dip, French onion chip dip. There's the uh, flaming hot lays. So yeah, barbecue with the heat turned up. Pretty good stuff. Mmm. Let's see what old butter box is up to over <laughs> here. <laughs> You're making ice cubes. I'm making ice and eating popcorn. <laughs> and you, d you didn't even share the recipe for your ice cubes with everybody. <laughs> It's a secret recipe. Now, I said these, these, I said they're not that hot, but for me, I'm, I'm used to spicy chips, so if you're not a fan or you're just starting to try um, spicier chips, that these are very hot. I like the barbecue flavor on those, and then the heat builds slowly. I like those, but I can only eat a handful because they do get spicy. Um, I would recommend like some sort of chip dip if you're gonna try to eat more than a handful of these because this kind of balances them out. And yeah. that's good. And this is good. Yeah. And Baba like it too. Go. <laughs> Lunch is ready. Mmm. Let me eat this. Now Nicole's typically a no ketchup. KD type of person. She loves it just the old fashioned way. Yeah, I I like it in there, but this is the way you eat it plain. Mm. And sometimes I like to scoop chips with it. I yep. mean, use a chip to scoop it. Yep. Sometimes. Sometimes if you get real crazy. You know? <laughs> now this is how real pros eat their KD. <laughs> I don't like ketchup, do you? And no sugar added. Of course. <laughs> Mix it all in. Yep. Mmm. Good? You made it perfect. Thanks. The right amount of creaminess. It's the extra creamy kind, by the way. Craft, extra creamy craft dinner. It's um the technique, how you guys do it if you want to know, you let your butter sit out on the box. <laughs> like 20 minutes before you make it. <laughs> That's the secret. Yes, and your milk. Don't forget your milk in a measuring cup. Yeah, but the butter on the box was the best <laughs> part. <laughs> I've been doing that since I was like 10. <laughs> mm. Nicole is gonna be a daredevil and go for it. Usually I dip plain ones in here and I'm gonna try it with these. Mmm, that's good. The barbecue with the craft dinner and the spice is good. And you know, re mm. remember the one day we had we, we had Hank we had bark. a loud dog. <laughs> remember the one day when we tried um, ketchup chips dipped in there? Oh, oh yeah, yeah, that, that was, was good. Really good. That was good too, but barbecue plain like not spicy would be good and these are awesome too. Yeah, so guys, let us know if you have any weird food combinations like. Um, the mm. plain chips good. are very good, but I think ketchup chips are the best. Like, does yeah. anyone does anyone else do that? No. <laughs> Maybe Hank. I'm unique. Yeah, I'll admit it's good though. I never tried it before I met you, mm. and then everything went downhill. Guys, I'm going rogue. Whoa! Look at that. Going rogue. See, sometimes I get, real, well, actually, lots of times I get good ideas. Mmm. You were right. Thanks. It's good, eh? It's a really good combination. Yeah. I would eat that a lot. It is actually very good, though. I'm not just being silly. It's very good. Mmm, good. Mm. Yum. Try it, guys. I, I don't steer you wrong. It's good. What the heck? I, I, I just... Said, hey, why not? <laughs> mm. Hey, there, 
I mean, it's white cheddar cheese. I can see that working. It's actually, it's actually really good. Uh, now that you mention it. Mmm. Want to bite? I'm gonna go like that. Oh yeah. He's turning into me. Mmm. Hey, when you have a good idea, I'll admit it. And that's a great one. The chips and the popcorn guys are awesome. It's a good way to mm. kick up uh, craft dinner, you know? I love it. I think you just reinvented the wheel. <laughs> okay, we're gonna film until you catch one because it's gonna be like, well, it'll be a seven hour film here. Oh, oh yeah, high five. That was awesome. I did it. Someone with zero coordination can do that. Oh God, okay, <laughs> we're gonna have injuries now. Oh, he did it again. You're going at 50% here. You're batting mm. 500. Now I cheat. Yeah. Oh, I like the way you No lunch would be complete without bada bing. Oh, you chose that one. I didn't even know which one you chose. Look at that, the tonight dough. This is one of my top, in the top five Ben and Jerry flavors I've ever had. It's very good. And just, <clears throat> it's got like everything you could ever dream of in it. Caramel and chocolate ice cream mixed with cookie swirls, gobs of chocolate chip cookie dough, and peanut butter cookie dough. Mmm. Ready to unbox? Ready. I'm not ready for ice cream yet. Too full? No, I just want to eat a donut. No, instead. well, I'll probably eat a donut too. <laughs> Look at that, you get chocolate oh. cookie, you get your caramel, your chocolate ice cream. Look at that. It is, it's really good, guys. Mmm, look at the chunks in there. There's, that's the cookie dough, it could, peanut butter cookie dough, I think it is. Mm. So good. That's good. Oh man. Mm. You guys, another recommendation from both of us. If you get the tonight dough, Give it a chance. Hey, you're cute. Hmm. <laughs> Hi, it's dinner time. Look at what we are eating. Look at what I don't we're know eating. why I shook my head like that. Cheeseburgers, bacon cheddar cheeseburgers to be exact. Yep. And we have out some mayo and chipotle mayo. And we're going to have some of those brazolio hamburger buns. Over there, extra sauce. Yep. And then, look at this. Take a peek. See in there? Mm. Lattice fries, deep fried in the oven from on top of the oven. <laughs> like that, see? Yeah, like that. <laughs> we have one more little batch coming. And the best thing to do is dip them in ranch <gasps> and ketchup. Yes. And guess what? We're calling them Seth Rollins fries because, <laughs> and he's a wrestler for any of you that don't know, but we watched a documentary and he said he liked to eat waffle fries and dip them in ranch when he was in high school. And so we're eating Seth Rollins fries. Yep. And that, my friends, will be the conclusion to our cheat day. Oh yeah. We hope that you have enjoyed it because we have and our bellies are happy. And it's gonna be even more happy when you eat one of those burgers. Yep. So, don't forget to check us out on Instagram and be our friends. And don't forget to like, to like and subscribe or else. Bye friends. Bye guys.